Hello everyone. Today we are here to discuss the previous year's questions from UPSC prelims examination. And as you know, the prelims season is coming, and in a few days you will also start preparing for the prelims with your hundred percent efficiency. So for that, you must first understand what are the uh, previous year's papers of the UPSC so that you get an idea. The UPSC makes questions on what lines. Although it is very difficult to predict any question, but still you must uh, at least appreciate the types of questions that UPSC is asking. So fr from that perspective, we will discuss some of the questions of the previous years. We will try to give you the answer. Plus, also I will try to give you some additional concepts so that uh, you can relate to uh, what type of conceptual clarity is needed. Plus, uh, in some of the questions, uh, still they are in the current affairs. Uh, due to some or the other recent news, so I will tell you the news also. So without wasting time, let's jump into the question and see what type of questions are there. India, uh, in which of the diseases have been eradicated from India? So uh, we have eradicated smallpox, chickenpox, and diphtheria. No, diphtheria. Only. So we we give the medicine. We give the DTAP. Na? Diphtheria is still there. Chickenpox is still there. So smallpox we have eradicated. So only three we have eradicated. In India, we have eradicated polio. In India, we have eradicated smallpox. We have eradicated yaws disease, and we have eradicated neonatal tetanus. We have eradicated rinderpest. It's a disease in the cattle. Uh, now, uh, something about the smallpox. Smallpox was the first vaccine to be made. The vaccine against smallpox was the first vaccine which was made. It was made by a scientist called as Edward Jenner. During his time. Smallpox was a pandemic. Like in in 2020, COVID was a pandemic. In that time, smallpox was a pandemic, and many people were dying from smallpox. So Edward Jenner observed that there were some milkmen who were who earlier suffered from cowpox, and once they suffered from cowpox, they did not get smallpox. So he concluded that there must be something in the cowpox virus which was making persons immune to smallpox. So what he did, he took the Uh, cowpox virus and in injected it into his son, and the son got cowpox. Cowpox was not that lethal, but then the son became immune to smallpox. This was the concept of the first vaccine which was created. Okay, so the after that there, there was a lot of research, and it was found that basically cowpox and smallpox they belong to the same family. Uh, it the the family is known as pox virale. And therefore, the antibodies which were created against cowpox, they were able to work against smallpox also. Okay. And in the recent times, this is again in news because monkeypox also belongs to the same family. So people are thinking that whether we can use the vaccine for smallpox against monkeypox also. Okay. So they are doing research on this. So this is the concept of the smallpox. So smallpox was the first uh, disease. Which had a vaccine, and smallpox was the first disease which was eradicated from the world. Also, smallpox was eradicated from the world in 1980s. Uh, uh, after that, many countries stopped giving smallpox vaccines to the people because we don't have smallpox anymore. ठीक है. तो ये smallpox की कहानी है. Tattooing. टैटू के थ्रू कौन कौन सी डिजीज स्प्रेड हो सकती है तो हेपेटाइटिस कैन स्प्रेड एंड एच आई वी कैन स्प्रेड चिकन गुनिया स्प्रेड बाई अगेन आई सेट एडीज एजिप्टी दिस एडीज एजिप्टी मॉस्किटो इज वेरी डेंजरस आई हैम मैंशनिंग इट थ्री थर्ड टाइम इन माई दिस डिस्कशन बिकॉज यू पी एस सी हैज फोकसड थ्री टाइम्स ऑन एडीज एजिप्टी एंड रिसेंटली मतलब ऑल आवर फोकस इज बेसिकली ऑन मॉस्किटो रिलेटेड डिजीजेस मलेरिया चिकन गुनिया डेंगू ठीक है ऑल दिस तो चिकन गुनिया स्प्रेड बाई एडीज एजिप्टी तो इट कैन नॉट बी स्प्रेड थ्रू ट्रैटिंग मतलब बॉडी फ्लूड्स बॉडी फ्लूड्स से स्प्रेड नहीं होता तो ये वन इज नॉट करेक्ट इसको हटा देंगे तो टू एंड थ्री इज द आंसर ठीक है तो बेसिकली एच आई वी कैन स्प्रेड थ्रू बॉडी फ्लूड्स जैसे कि ब्लड और सीमन And similarly, hepatitis B can also spread through body fluids. I have already explained in the previous. So hepatitis B again, again it is asked. Like it was asked before also. We have discussed it. Again it is asked. Uh, HIV. I told you that HIV virus destroys the destroys the uh, helper T cell. ठीक है तो T cell question was asked. So you can see the pattern. There are few topics which are very very important and which often come in news, and the questions are. basically encircling these topics 
इसके आसपास के ही क्वेश्चन होते हैं तो इफ़ यू इफ़ यू डेवलप अ कॉन्सेप्चुअल क्लैरिटी ऑन फ्यू टॉपिक्स देन यू कैन सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन वेरी ईजली नाउ दिस क्वेश्चन आई हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड कि वायरसेज डोंट हैव एनजाइम्स viruses cannot reproduce on their own viruses cannot survive on their own in order to survive in order to make copies of themselves they need a host cell a living cell which can do this for them to so viruses infect the living cell enter the living cell hijack the living cell and then the living cell that is maybe uh, human cell or any bacteria it can make then it the living cell makes copies of the virus this is how virus reproduces and in this process the living cell or the host cell it will die and many copies of the virus will be created these copies of the virus will spread to other cells theek hai to viruses lack enzyme necessary for generation of energy this is true <coughs> they cannot be cultured in synthetic medium it means ki uh, synthetic medium is basically if you take a bowl very simply if you take a bowl and uh, put all the nutrients in the bowl jaise ki protein carbohydrate fat vitamins minerals and you uh, add some water etc theek hai to whatever is needed as food by the virus if you add that and then you add the virus the virus will not grow because virus cannot reproduce on itself for virus to grow you need a living cell so when we have to grow virus first we grow the bacteria ठीक है तो इट इज अ बेसिकली बायोलॉजिकल मीडियम तो सिंथेटिक मीडियम में हम नहीं कर सकते वी नीड अ लिविंग मीडियम लिविंग कल्चर ठीक है उसके अंदर वी ग्रो द वायरस तो वायरस इज कैन नॉट बी ग्रोन इन सिंथेटिक मीडियम तो दिस इज नॉट ट्रू तो इफ यू एलिमिनेट टू दीज टू स्टेटमेंट्स आर गॉन वन इज करेक्ट तो वन एंड थ्री तो थ्री में वायरस इज आर ट्रांसमिटेड फ्रॉम वन ऑर्गेनिज्म टू अदर बाय बायोलॉजिकल वैक्टर्स ओनली दिस इज नॉट करेक्ट जैसे डेंगू वायरस इज ट्रांसमिटेड फ्रॉम वन पर्सन टू अदर थ्रू मॉस्किटो चिकनगुनिया इज ट्रांसमिटेड थ्रू मॉस्किटो बट कोविड वायरस कोविड वायरस इज ट्रांसमिटेड फ्रॉम वन पर्सन टू अदर थ्रू ड्रॉपलेट्स वेन एवर अ पर्सन हु हैज कोविड दे विल कॉफ द ड्रॉपलेट्स विल कम आउट दीज ड्रॉपलेट्स विल कंटेन कोविड वायरस एंड इफ समबडी एल्स गेट्स इन टच इन विद दीज ड्रॉपलेट्स देन कोविड वायरस कैन स्प्रेड एंड वी हैव सीन एच आई वी वायरस एच आई वी वायरस स्प्रेड्स थ्रू ब्लड so there there is no vector which is involved there is no carrier which is involved in between so this statement about only is incorrect okay so it can be spread by vector it can be spread uh, by droplets it can be spread by by body fluids it can be spread by other means also okay so ye statement galat hai only one is the correct option i conclude my discussion thank you everyone